Hi, welcome to Keysight Bench Real Lab Feature Guide. In this video, I will demonstrate the Lab Administrator feature which allows the educator to monitor the current instrument connection status and easily identify which instrument on which bench is not correctly connected. To check the instrument status, click on the Lab Administrator tab and click on the Check Instrument Status icon at the top left. The connection status of all configured instruments will be updated and displayed in the following color codes. Green indicate connected and active instruments. Red indicate disconnected or connection error. And gray out indicate instruments that are not configured yet. Lab Administrator also allows the lecturer to configure the measurements, state or settings of all the instruments on the benches in bulk easily. This feature enables centralized control for the lecturer to quickly reset or send a preset measurement state or setting to all the instruments at once for a specific measurement session. To send a preset measurement state or setting, click the Send Instrument Configuration icon. On the pop-up menu, click the arrow icon for drop-down menu of the desired instrument type. Function Generator is selected for this example. Click Add to Reason Configuration List to browse and select the Save Function Generator state file. Click Send Configuration File to All Instruments. The measurement state for all the instruments connected to Benchview Lab Manager will be automatically configured according to the state file. You may also reset all the settings of the instruments to default by clicking Send Default Configuration Reset. The default configuration will be automatically updated on the instrument. To create a new preset measurement state file, go to the application tab on the BenchView platform Launch the BenchView application for the desired instrument type. For this example, a state file of function generator is created by launching the BenchView function generator app. Click Connect to the instrument. The instrument must be connected and powered on. Configure the desired measurement setting and parameters. For example, for channel 1, select the sine waveform. Input the desired parameters. You may also set the parameters for channel 2 as well. Please note that if the instrument is currently acquiring measurement, the state file cannot be saved. The measurement acquisition must be stopped first. Click the save icon to save the parameters state files. You may rename the state file name and change the directory of the saved file. The instrument state file is saved in a proprietary format .state file extension and can now be used to configure all the instruments at once via BenchView Lab Manager. That is the end of this video. Thank you for watching.